In this video, we'll summarize Open Up 7th Grade Unit 1 Lesson 1, What Are Scaled Copies? All right, today's goal is number one, I want you to be able to tell whether or not a figure is a scaled copy of another figure. And two, I can describe some characteristics of a scaled copy. So in class, we looked at this original drawing of the letter F and some other drawings in the letter. I would like you to take a moment just to relook at these and decide which of the drawings are scaled copies of the original. Pause the video and then come back and check if you're correct. All right, I hope you said drawing one, drawing two, and drawing seven. Let's get a little bit more specific as to why those three work. Notice in drawing one that every single side length is the original side length times 1.5. Like this top bar is 2 in the original and it's 3 here. 2 times 1.5 is 3. The middle bar is 1 and here it's 1.5. And, and if you check the left side as well, you're going to see the same relationship. In drawing 2, you're going to notice it has the original measurements times 2 and drawing 7 always takes the original measurements times 3. Right, I want you to see if you can figure out why the other four drawings are not scaled copies. So go ahead and see if you can figure out a good reason for each. All right, your reasons may not match mine exactly, but let's see how you did. So drawing three, notice it got wider, but it didn't get taller. It didn't grow proportionally, just in one direction. Drawing four, the angles changed. It doesn't even look like the same. Drawing five, in my opinion, that one's the trickiest. Every single part of it is multiplied by 1.5, except the middle bar is multiplied by two. So it's very subtly not similar. And drawing six, kind of on the same, everything is times 0.5. It's half as big as the original, except that middle bar is times one. It's the same size. All right, I want you to ask yourself, what are some characteristics of scaled copies? By the end of today, you should be able to at least know these few things. One, in scaled copies, the shape is always the same. Two, the angles are always the same. And then this is the big hard one. The side lengths of one figure are always multiplied by the same number, and that number is called the scale factor, to get the corresponding side lengths of the other figure. We'll work on that quite a bit more throughout this unit. So today, do you feel like at this point you can tell whether or not a figure is a scaled copy of another figure? And can you describe some characteristics of a scaled copy? How about these two bitmojis? Are they scaled copies? All right, I'll see you in class. Have a wonderful day.